what's up you guys it's your boy Jose and for today I'm gonna show you my EDC and what I carry in my backpack every day because well I think it's a perfect topic it's back to school season so you probably will want to know what to carry every day but also even if you're out of school like I am I graduated about two years ago I think I still use a backpack every day so even if you're a business professional or you're doing your own thing having a backpack to carry your everyday essentials it's crucial so let me show you what let me let me go get my backpack to show you what I carry And here's my personal backpack and actually, you know what? much better. So this is going to be a way better format for me to show you exactly what's in my book bag. So this is what I carry every day and obviously your biggest and most important EDC is going to be the actual book bag that you're carrying it in. The two biggest things you want in your book bag, one you want to make sure it's quality built, something that's durable obviously because you're going to be wearing every day. This is going to be your workhorse so you got to make sure it can keep up with your lifestyle and protect the things that are inside. Two, you want it to make, make sure it's versatile and something that's practical that you can wear it both dressed down and dressed up, especially if you're a business professional. It could be something that you can look good in the office with or on college campus. And this one, which is from Carl Friedrich, which is my everyday one, I think this one pretty much nails it on the head. This is the one I use every day in the practical design. This is what you should look for. It's minimal, it's clean, it's masculine, and, in a good, and it looks good in a professional setting and in a casual setting. Now, what I like about the backpack is that minimal design and the fact that it's super lightweight. The bigger the backpack is, the more you'll be inclined to like just fill it with clutter that you don't need. While when you keep it nice and minimal, thin and like this, you keep your essentials, the stuff that you really will use every day and will help you out. And that way you keep your carry as light as possible. So this Carl Friedrich nailed it on the head when it came to design. As for quality, this is unparalleled. You buy a Carl Friedrich backpack, you basically have top of the line. Honestly, any Carl Friedrich product, for example, the leather, it's vegetable tan leather. And honestly, it only gets better with age. And I'm speaking from experience because I've used their products for about two to three years now. And I still have the same product and they just look better and better and better the more you wear it. That's the type of product you want if you're going to be using it every single day for a long period of time. This backpack is also made with an Italian heavy duty nylon canvas in the front, which is durable, exactly what you want, not only to protect the things on the inside, but also make sure the backpack won't tear easily, especially if it's cheap. And why, honestly, I recommend this backpack to any guy looking for a good one. If you guys wanna check it out, it's gonna be linked down below. But now let's roll into what's inside. So let's open this up. So let's go over some of the small stuff that's inside my backpack. One of the most important things with your EDC is stuff that you use every day. So for example, the first thing that came out, wipes. These are super important, especially if you get any ink stains or grease stains on you. These can easily help you remove them. On top of that, if it's a hot day or a long day, you can clean up your face and your hands so you always look fresh. Which speaking about remaining fresh, tied to go pen. This goes with me everywhere. Just imagine you're on a date and you noticed you stained yourself. That's embarrassing. Well, not for me because I always have this. And if I see it, you can discreetly just go to the restroom and quickly pull this out and just erase all your problems away. Let's just stick to grooming while we're at it. The next item, a small fragrance, a small bottle of cologne. Do I even need to explain this? Women love men who smell good. I want women to love me, so I smell good all the time. Duh. But seriously, boys, get a small bottle of fragrance. It's a lifesaver. And no, Axe body spray is not acceptable. The next item up, and this again, it's with me every single day headphones, and particularly the Apple AirPod. These go with me everywhere from audiobooks to listening to music, whether I'm in the gym, whether I'm working, wherever I am, these are easy to just plug in, tune out, or even take calls hands-free while I'm doing other things. And when I was in college, these were lifesavers. I love the fact that they're wireless, you can easily sneak them in and just enjoy your content. Now I know I'm going through a lot and I still have about six or seven more items to go through. So here's the tip I'm gonna give you. If you're also wanting to build your own personal EDC and you wanna take inspiration from this, I suggest start making a list. So make a list of the things that I'm talking about that you think you wanna add or would help you to look better, feel better, etc. And the easiest way to do that, do it online using ShopTagger, which is a completely free app. I've told you countless of times to download it. You should have downloaded it by now. If you haven't, there's a link down below. I'll wait. Literally just click the link. It downloads for free on your iPhone or your computer. And it's one of the best resources to have 
to shop online because it allows you to tag things as you see them so you get reminded of what you want. On top of that, you can categorize those items so you have organized list of things that you want. That way when you have extra spending capital, you can go back and what you need to buy first and what you want. As those items start going on sale, which most do every season, you're gonna get an email from ShopTagger letting you know that X item went on sale. That way it saves you money and you probably already forgot about that item, but ShopTagger, since you tagged it, they're always keeping track of it for you, whether it comes back on stock, your size is restocked, or when it goes on sale to make sure you buy it at the best deal possible. If you do any sort of online shopping, whatever it is doesn't matter what you type of things you buy you need to have shop tagger on your phone or on your computer and it's a completely free app you pay for nothing and it's unobtrusive it won't spam you and you only use it when you're tagging items that you actually want so click that link below and download it it's free all right so moving along there's a front tab here this zipper I actually really like because it's kind of like easy access so here I have my really really important stuff like my cell phone and my wallet and of course cell phone this is an obvious one everybody carries one but what is not as obvious is carrying it in a stylish case I use this beautiful cognac leather one that this is also from Carl Friedrich just so you can see the craftsmanship of work that they do this one actually even has a slot for a credit card which is super efficient because it will reduce the bulk of me needing to carry a wallet in certain occasions and I can just have my license and one credit card on my phone case and I'm good to go which rolls us on to the seventh essential and it's your wallet again this is super important picture this you're on a date or you're in a meeting with a client or with a potential client that you're trying to sell and you pull out a crappy wallet all those small details add to your overall image so your wallet it's just as important as everything else you carry and this is a definite everyday carry so here again a full grain leather wallet it's super thin it doesn't look messy and it looks expensive this one also is from Carl Friedrich again Carl Friedrich kind of just does all types of leather goods which if you want to check them out the link will be below but this is a great card case the seventh essential and probably my personal most important one my laptop so this is a 15 inch macbook pro with touch bar one of my favorite laptops to use i do all my work on here emails editing my business everything is run from here so this is probably the most important thing that i carry every single day and kind of to protect it i use i like to use this sleeve also from carl friedrich vincetta leather and it matches my iphone case which i think looks pretty aesthetic i like the look of that number nine chapstick boys every guy should carry chapstick mainly because those crusty lips of yours aren't kissable and if you want to look kissable you want to carry chapstick number 10 an external battery pack i just hate looking for juice or an outlet so this this is a lifesaver every single time number 11 gum or mints whatever you choose but one of my biggest fears is kissing a girl and my breath being raunchy that girl isn't gonna call me back so I always have these with me. I recommend them. And finally, but certainly not least, number 12, a water bottle. These are those dual aluminum water bottles that keep things super cold all day. And you wanna know the secret to beautiful skin? Drink a crap load of water. I fill this up about eight to 10 times a day. So a water bottle for me, definite essential. And that's basically it guys. Those are the top essentials that I think every guy should own. If you guys liked this video and found it informative, don't forget to drop us a like down below. If you wanna buy any of it, like I said, all the leather products are from Carl Friedrich. The rest, just create a list with ShopTiger. It's the best way to keep track of it. So that's it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time.